What is going on guys? It is Ryan. Today I got some awesome video showing the new Royal map. Um, actually it is not out yet and this isn't my gameplay. So on the left you're going to see someone else's face cam. That is not me. So I don't want you guys talking about how, oh I look like, you know, I look like this or this is my gameplay because this isn't my gameplay. I asked this the, uh, this creator if I could use his video and he said yes, he's another Ironside partner. I'll have his link for his YouTube in the description below. I'll have Yuppie's uh, link in the description which helped me leak the last video. And I'll have the Ironside application for the partnership program down below. They just opened it back up. If you want to be a partner for Ironside, uh, Ironside they do do like IRL stuff. They'll send us like, you know, they send us free stuff. Sometimes they'll send us supply drop. So if you guys want to get on that, go check that out. I might make a video soon about it. Um, so basically on screen as you guys can see you'll see the mini map the loading screen which looks amazing and then gameplay for the map now when i've talked to this guy about what it feels like he said it feels like a black ops 2 map basically the yacht map for black ops 2 um but to me it looks like yeah the yacht from black ops 2 but it also looks like that skateboarding park from black ops 2 that map and it just everything about this map is amazing i think this map will be the best for showing off skins commentaries because it's so colorful because you know viewers love colorful I think this whole map is just amazing. I think this is one of the best maps they've made. Um, release date on this. So I actually know that this won't be in the next update. So this today is June 22nd, and I asked the community manager, uh, manager, which is kind of the guy on the dev team, when this map will be released. He said it's not going to be released next update. It'll be in the next couple updates that they'll release it. So to me, that means we'll get it in a month or two. Because when I went on their Twitter as well, they have hashtag Taco Tuesday, hashtag Tease and stuff, and it shows this like picture of this kind of map, and it's like this taco hut, you know, this taco nope. building. So I think we're gonna get an urban map with a whole bunch of like, you know, a street with shops on it and stuff, and the next update, which would probably be the 25th or 26th, so in the next week we're probably gonna get another map before this map. So I think once a month or every couple weeks they're gonna release a map, which is gonna be insane. Um, hopefully, I really want this map. This map looks the best out of any map we've seen. So it's going to be interesting to see if they're going to release this map sooner than we they told me or if they were just like being honest with me or maybe they could have been lying to hype everyone up. So anyways, like I said, as you guys can see on screen, this map looks amazing. It's very different from any other map, honestly. Other maps are very groggy and gross. Like the newest map we got was Ironwork and that one's kind of bland and stuff and they all the maps kind of look similar, but this one very like stands out to me, honestly. And I know a couple uh, other YouTubers started making videos about the Royal, which you guys haven't seen, by the way. I should link the other video of how I found this out and who helped me figure this out. It will be in the description as well, so I got tons of links down there for you guys. Um, yeah, so it's just really weird to think that this is Iron Sight now. Like, uh, all the other maps I've seen that I haven't even talked about yet look completely different. So I'm pretty sure that they're taking this game very serious. Now, if you guys are wondering where I got this gameplay... Um, so back in the day, the Korean up, uh, servers actually had this map on it, and with, that's why all the text looks weird and stuff. So you can no longer get on the Korean servers, and that's why it might be a little laggy in this gameplay, because he's on the Korean servers. So you guys can't get any more gameplay of this. The gameplay that's on YouTube is the one you can get. So anyways, um, another thing I wanted to talk about is the community updates. Uh, they're on number 13 right now. I know the last one I made was 8 or 9. Um, there hasn't been anything big in the updates, except for there's a couple of... Hey, in the next week, there's going to be a huge update. So, I think in the next week, we're going to get a huge update with a new map and maybe a new game mode. And I also wanted to talk about the game mode-wise of this map. So, I think every map we're going to get a game mode, which with Ironwork, we got free-for-all and custom maps. But I'm pretty sure we're either going to get free-for-all or domination. And the reason I say that is because they already have free-for-all in the game. Why wouldn't they just release it to the public? We already have it in custom. And I was told on the Korean updates, or the Korean servers, we've had they had domination on them. Which is very interesting on this map. Which, if you guys don't know what Domination is, Black Ops 2 is basically the most popular game for Domination that people know it from. It's basically a search and destroy with unlimited lives. Which one team tries to plant the bomb, it's really easy to defuse, I mean, destroy the first bomb, but the second bomb, you have to destroy two and then it switch sides. So, you know, nothing too big. Another thing I haven't really talked about much about this game or the developer is that they are really working on internal stuff right now. I remember when I first started playing this game, every update they were releasing new skins new maps new you know anything but i've noticed they've been working on a lot of the internal stuff if you go into the community updates they talk about how they're working on the servers or they're working on just anything in general and they've had a lot of server uh, server maintenance everyone's saying they never update this game but they update it every week just like fortnite they do server maintenance though and the difference is people don't understand that server maintenance is just as good as getting new weapons and skins because if the servers are garbage because people always say the hit detection is garbage in this game where the servers suck but they're working on that every week, which people don't understand that if you don't, like, 
just because they don't release weapons, skins, or maps right now, they're still updated in the game. They're just doing it secretly. Or they might be working on a couple huge updates. So right now, they're not going to have anything for a month or two. But the month or two after that, they're going to have like a new map, new skins, new characters, new everything. Now, I do also have a couple of new characters and skins and stuff I was going to show off in this video. But I actually am going to wait to do a separate video on those. Just so I don't, for like, you know, so people remember those skins and stuff. Because this map is huge and it's amazing. And I just want to give my input and talk about how... Everyone is saying this game is either dying or growing. Honestly, it's growing. No matter how much people say this game is dying because they're not updating in quotation, it's not going to go anywhere. This game is growing huge. I'm pretty sure it's going to, you know, be a really big PC game. And all the updates and stuff, as I've seen, they have tons of maps coming. The reason they're not updating it right now is because they're fixing the servers, like I said. They're doing all the internal stuff so then they can do external, which a lot of Call of Duty games, for example, don't do. Like Infinite Warfare or Black Ops 3, they didn't fix the servers. They added more supply drop weapons that ruined the servers. And then people were like, oh, at least they're updating it. But yet, they weren't doing the things that made the game great. So I just that's just my input. So in the next couple updates, get ready for skins, game modes, up, maps, and just new characters. We really don't know what's going to happen with this community. Um, they're very busy as well working with the partners. Like, you know, bring us IRL stuff so we can do some giveaways. So thank you guys so much for watching. Please like, subscribe, and comment. I know I kind of went on the rant at the last minute. But just, like I said, just because they're not updating it that we can see doesn't mean they're not updated at all. So I just want to give you, you guys thank you for all the support on the last video. If we can get like 8,000 views on this, maybe a couple hundred likes and like 50 to 100 comments, that would be insane. And I think that's going to be you guys. Have a great day.